morning lifestyle lovers welcome back to it's e lifestyle and if you are new here welcome my name is erica my channel is called it's e lifestyle and it is all about creating a good lifestyle okay lifestyle lovers so this is the start of a new vlog today is wednesday i'm actually headed into the office today and i wanted you guys to see what i'm wearing to work a few vlogs back i shared some pants from J Lux label it's actually a two-piece set but I told you guys how versatile the pants were so now I actually have three sets of these two-piece sets but one of the things that I was explaining to you guys that I really really love about them because it's actually a weekend outfit it's a go out outfit but the pants you can transition them to work wear so I am wearing a pair of the pants today and I wanted to share that with you guys. So this is actually the pair of pants that I am wearing. This is a new mirror by the way. So one of the reasons that I purchased this mirror is so I can kind of do stuff like this very quickly without being in my bedroom because I have a huge mirror in my bedroom but of course my bed is not made and all that stuff. But anyway, so these are the pants to the brown set that I had that I have I'll insert the whole outfit on the screen somewhere so you guys can see but I'm wearing them to work today and I basically just paired them with this tan bodysuit from Express and this brown blazer from Express so I'm just wearing a few different color neutrals these are the sandals that I'm going to wear, which is also a neutral. These are by Nine West. This is the Rena sandal. You actually need several pairs of these as well because these are great, comfortable, very versatile. I just ordered these in black and red. So if they come while I'm still filming this vlog, I'll share them with you guys. But very comfortable. So I wanted to kind of show you guys what I was wearing to work today. I just threw a few curls in my hair and yeah, I'm headed out the door. The perfume that I have been wearing lately that I absolutely love, 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 love is, make sure I don't have my address showing on no bills back right there. But um, I went into LV a few weeks ago um, and I purchased some things out of LV and they gave me some perfume samples and I love them they smell so good so the two that I've been switching back and forth is spell on you this is by Louis Vuitton and the other one is symphony so I actually did not have anything on my Christmas list but now I do because both of these smell so good so I've just kind of been putting them down in my purse but I think I'm just going to wear the spell on you today so yeah lifestyle lovers these smell so 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 good and i actually i have and i got a little bracelet i think this is from um venus venus has some really nice uh accessories by the way uh so yeah I do have a Louis Vuitton bottle of perfume that my daughter purchased me for my birthday. And this is actually the Attrape Reves. This is the one that I have. And then it has, she got my initials engraved on it, which is EM. She has my initials engraved, engraved on the bottle, which is EM. But I actually like these better than the Attrape Reves. I thought this was the best scent. Um, so yeah, I got something on my Christmas list if my daughter or my man is watching. That's one of the things I want. One of them. <laughs> and they also gave me some other samples. Looks, okay, this is a trap. Okay, so she gave me some samples of a trap a Reves, which is the one that I have the full size bottle in. But yeah, I just wanted to go ahead and start the vlog. Um, I don't know what's upcoming in this vlog, but I'm thinking I want a new Christmas tree. So after work, I may go to Home Depot and kind of check out some of their Christmas trees. So I can tell you that could possibly be in this vlog. Um, but right now, I'm headed to work. I need to get out the door. So I'll check back in with you guys later. Take it first. 
to end its cleaning job and return home. Good morning, Lifestyle Lovers. Happy Saturday. So today is Saturday. I kind of just got in from Babe's house. So I'm kind of been doing some cleaning, trying to get my house together. I just, um, so I pretty much just been doing some cleaning, trying to get my house together. I think I'm going to, go ahead and start pulling out the Christmas decorations to kind of see what I have um, and decide if I'm going to get another tree. So pretty much this morning, um, I spent the night at Babe House. So I got up and made us some breakfast. I made some cinnamon toast crunch, French toast, which was really good with some turkey bacon. Um, so I just kind of got in and I'm trying to get my house together so I can kind of start decorating to see what I have. I got a order from Crate and Barrel yesterday, but I've already opened it because I'm so impatient. So as soon as I got home from work, I just kind of came in and cracked the box open. But I'm gonna share with you guys what I ordered from Crate and Barrel because I know I'm looking very dusty, but I'm getting ready to kind of get myself together. I'm going to Babe's um, niece birthday party. So we're gonna go to the birthday party and um, and then I'm just gonna continue with my day. Uh, so I told, so, oh, that's the washing machine. So I told you guys probably on the last vlog that um, I typically do not buy Christmas decorations until I'm done decorating and then I kind of see what I need because Christmas decorations are expensive. So typically what I try to do is kind of add something um, into my Christmas collection every year. Last year I did a snowman. I bought like these, um, these globe bowls and I made a snowman and I had it here on my coffee table. So that was kind of like you know what i incorporated into my decorations 
last year so i'm just gonna see what i plan to incorporate this year um but i did see some items at cb2 that i wanted to grab before they possibly could start be sold out you know cb2 is always has like a, either a long shipping time or the item is sold out which was actually um these little glass uh snow 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 snowman but i guess they they it really doesn't even have to be a snowman these can just be like some sculptures that you can decorate year round with but i'm gonna use them as snowman i may even do some little eyes and a mouth and all of that on it and then once christmas is over i may just keep them um on my bookshelf but this one was 19.99 i think it was 20 dollars, and this one was 10 if i'm not mistaken if i'm wrong i'll put it on the screen but they were not that much and it's just like a simple modern christmas decor which i think i'm actually going to try to go for this year and so that was the first thing i ordered and i ordered this little vase as well this was on sale for like 20 dollars i think the regular price might be 30 dollars oh shit <laughs> oh it almost fell y'all but you can put something in it it's kind of heavy and it almost slipped out of my hand but um it doesn't have the price on it but it's not as white as i would have wanted it to be it's kind of like a, a off-white more like a cream color so this was the other item that i picked up from cb2 and this was the fourth item that i picked up which is like it has the match sticks in it it's like it's called a match cloak i think that's how you pronounce it but this was i want to say like 20 or 30 dollars they had a larger one which was probably about 50 dollars but i want to say this one was like 25 so i had purchased this to kind of go on my island but once I put it on the island, I don't particularly care for it up there. I'm going to show you guys kind of how it looks on the island. So this is how it looks. I have my chairs up on my island because basically when I really, really want um, my iRobot to do like a very thorough cleaning, I'll go ahead and just kind of put my chairs um, up. That way it doesn't have any obstructions. But I don't really care for it right here so i don't think i'm gonna leave it there i may move it over to um i may just kind of i think i kind of like it better on the coffee table but of course i probably will need to replace that with a candle because it makes sense to have it next to next to a candle but i'm just gonna put it back on the island for now but I don't really I don't really care for it up there it doesn't look that good and my flowers are dying as well So that's pretty much probably what's going to be um in this vlog kind of preparing for um Christmas decor I'm not gonna fully do any decorating but i am going to start pulling my things out to kind of see what i have start doing some cleaning on my bookshelf but right now i'm going to go ahead and prepare um for the birthday party because i don't have long for that and then we'll probably continue with the vlog once i get back hey lifestyle lovers so it is way 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 later um in the day so we ended up going to my niece's first birthday party and I came home and I took a nap and I pretty much have been in the bed ever since then. Um, it's Saturday night. I don't know if I told you guys that, but I was planning, well, me and Babe was, you know, probably going to try to do something once he gets off, which is like right now because it is 7 p.m. And we talked about going to see um, the new movie Wakanda. Um, I heard it's real good. I've been hear hearing great reviews about it. But the movie is two hours and 40 minutes long. So, baby, I'm not, I'm not sitting in a movie theater for three hours. 
I told him we may have to wait to that, wait that we can watch that on the fire stick and do like a Wakanda night, a celebration, because I will fall asleep. I get bored. I have like a short attention span. So if it doesn't like catch my attention right away, I'm gonna be snoozing. So um, I just got out of the bed. I think I'm gonna go ahead and pull the Christmas tree out like I wanted to do earlier, but I didn't because I was being lazy. Um, I have like some crab legs and Dungeness crabs that were in the freezer and some lobsters. I think I'm gonna boil them. Order my son a pizza. I have turned on the fireplace. I am trying to get in the Christmas holiday spirit. And pour me a glass of wine. Start my decoration process. Oh, let me see. Baby, baby. Oh, you know what? I had the, girl, I had the wrong light on. Okay, I had the wrong lights on, so I, I think the lighting has changed. But I'm gonna pour me a glass of wine, and I'm gonna chill on this good Saturday night. I may log on to CB2. They have a sale going on. I got like a text about their sale. So I kinda been eyeing some stuff. I don't know if I'm gonna order it, but we shall see. So that, is what my Saturday night <laughs> will consist of lifestyle offers. I'm tired, very, very, very tired. Okay, I can immediately tell that <laughs> I want me a new tree, y'all. So this is my white tree. This is the one that I typically place in that corner over there. And this is my green tree and it'll go right here. But I flocked this tree myself a couple of years ago. And as you can see, most of the flock is like, off of it so i don't think i'm gonna like it but i'm going to put it up anyway just to see but i think i want me a new tree i don't want to spend the money for a new tree but i want me a new tree so I'm trying to decide should i go get it before home depot closes because I want me a new tree, lifestyle lovers. Okay, lifestyle lovers, so I ran to Home Depot. I want to show you guys the tree. Um, it's a seven and a half foot tree because my ceilings are eight foot long and it is pre-lit. So you can do, I'm, I'm looking at it, so you can do the colorful bulbs or the white bulbs. So this is how it looks with this is the color for bulbs which i probably won't use um but then it'll switch out to the white bulbs this is the price oh, that i don't want to pay but it's it says it's it says it's a quick set tree only one plug easy assemble color changing and this one is really really pretty as well this one has the pine cones on it i like that one as well that one is very i like that one this one is very classic um so i could do something like this one this one is 2.99 and then you have some other ones. Look at that. So, 
I'm gonna check their inventory, see if they have it, and take it home. And it don't look like they have it from what I can see right now. But um, I'll check back in with you guys once I get to the house. The lifestyle lovers. We don't feel. I got y'all, y'all virtual nephew, right here. Yeah, y'all like my new hoodie. You like my new pullover. Come on, go eat. I go gotta eat. see shit. Who we on the phone with? Cordell. Okay, lifestyle lovers. So I made it back home. They only had one tree in stock, and pretty much the guy at Home Depot said that the one tree in stock was probably the one that I was looking at. Um. So they, ha they have a few others around town and other stores, but I think it may have been meant for my store that was close to my home not to have that tree because, uh. <clears throat> because I may just need to work with what I have. So um, I'm gonna go ahead, pull the tree out, put it up. I purchased some of this like um, spray, spray on snow. Um, and I'm just gonna see what it looks like. If I really, really don't like it, I'll go. I'll go get a get another tree maybe tomorrow or sometime this week. But I'm gonna try to work with what I have. Um, I really, I really what I really didn't want to spend three hundred dollars on a tree. So um, I'm gonna just work with what I have. I have two trees, a white one and a green one. So um, once I get it up, I'll show you guys the, uh, you know how it looks. I have my trench on today. I pulled my trench out because it is trench weather. So I'm probably going to run this outfit back sometime um, again because I like the way it looks. I want to get a few more of these like one piece jumpers. I just kind of paired it with a one piece jumper and did my Jordan ones. And then I had on my LB hat. It was like a real cute look. Um, but I'm going to run this back so you guys will get to see the look again. But, uh, let's get this tree up and see what it's looking like. so I just poured me a glass of wine and I will tell you every single time I try to move out of my comfort zone and try some new red wine I end up not liking it so this one is the cupcake sweet red tastes like communion wine <laughs> tastes like great communion wine this is what this tastes like this is the other one, which I've kind of been drinking, but I really don't like it. But since, you know, I bought it, I was going to drink it. It's called Ameris, and it's, it's, a, it's another sweet red. So I just mix them together. I hope I don't get sick, but it tastes good. So I'm kind of out of my Dublin. Um, I, you know, I, I buy like a few bottles every two weeks. I'll get like four to five bottles um, every two weeks. And I'm trying to kind of get out of my comfort zone and try new red wine, but every time I do it, I don't like it. It tastes nasty. So, but I mixed it together. I hope I don't get sick because it tastes real good. So, yeah, I took a bottle of Dublin over to my sister's house this week. And um, I just kind of, you know, I had a glass while I was over there, but I left the bottle there. But I love my Dublin. I don't like nothing else. What do you want? Yeah, everybody told me happy birthday. Yes, everybody told you happy birthday. You need to say thank you. Thank you. Thank you for the birthday wishes. Now your birthday is over. No, it's not. Yes, it is. My birthday all year. My birthday all year. For November 6th, for the rest of the year. Don't y'all get tired of him. Don't y'all get tired of him. He is a heathen. 
You got your social, um, did Cordell, you did your social studies project? Yeah. Well, why you ain't did yours? Cause we didn't go get the, um, the, um, stuff I need. Bro, why you didn't do it with me, bro? <laughs> you lost, wait, you did it for real? Yeah, for Miss Jones. Bro, that was, uh, that was like, that was in, that was, that was in, bro. It was being due. No, no, I get an extra week because, um, I lost my poster, the first poster. Cause how I, you lost the, how you lost the whole poster? Because I was looking for my chain. Uh-oh, it was due last week. I was looking for my chain, that's the day I lost my poster. Good morning, lifestyle lovers. Happy Thanksgiving Eve. So today is actually Wednesday. It's a few days later. The last time you guys seen me, I pretty much cut the camera because I had to get on my son behind. I had to get on Mookie behind because unbeknownst to me, he was turning the project in late. We did the project. He made an A on the project, but I had to, I had to get on his behind. I know some of y'all you know, some of y'all be right here with me when I be getting on his behind and, and some of y'all, you know, <laughs> don't be like when I be getting on his behind, but I, I, I have to explain to him. And if any of you mothers are out there raising, you know, African-American young men, boys, they're going to be men. They're going to grow up to be men. If they're two, three, four, five. 14, they're gonna grow up to be men. So I have to explain to, explain to him, as an African-American male, your glass is already half full. It doesn't matter where you live. It doesn't matter how much money your parents make, or, or you can go to the best of schools or whatever the case may be, his glass is already half full. So, you know, I try to strive for him to do his best. He's super, super smart, but he wants to be cool and have his swag and, you know, but, you know, that's my child. I love him. And I pray for both of my kids. But Mookie, his prayers are a little bit more detailed. They're a little longer. And I pray a little harder for him. But anyway, he, he got to end on the project if you guys want to know what happened with that last scene. But it's the top of the morning. I'm getting ready to start my work day. I do have to work today. I just wanted to share with you guys the trees before I close out the vlog. Um, I did put the tree up. I did spray the fake snow and stuff on it. And I still do not like it. I'm going to show you guys. You guys can tell me what you think. But I, de I did end up ordering the tree. Um, I went to a few Home Depots um, in Jacksonville. They did not have it. That tree was sold out. So I just ordered it online. It'll be here Friday, which is probably the next time that I'm going to pick up the camera. So I'm just show you guys the trees. This is my white tree that I placed in the kitchen. I've been doing that probably for the last two years. Um, I don't decorate this tree. You can do white lights or you can do the colorful lights, but I kind of keep it simple and clean and just do the white lights. I still need to kind of fluff it out some more. So I fluffed it out a little bit, but I need to fluff it out some more. But that one is really, really thick, like really, really full. And this is <laughs> my other tree, which I do not like. So I'm going to give you guys a full view. You can kind of tell me what you think, but I don't like it. I really don't. I'm going to show you how it looks with lights. And I even like it even less with the lights. And there's actually some spaces where lights are missing. So this is the tree um, and these are my decorations. I think I have more that I need to pull out of my garage, but this is what I have so far. I did blue last year. My colors were silver, blue and white, but this year I'm going to do black and white. So there's some black and white bulbs down there. So I'm not going to throw this tree away. I'm just going to keep it. And maybe it'll just go upstairs or whatever the case may be. I am going to keep it. I'm not going to throw it away. But I am going to be replacing um, my Christmas tree. But that's it for this video, Lifestyle Lovers. I hope you have a great week. A great weekend. A great holiday. A great Thanksgiving. And I'll see you on the next video.
bye.